150,000 people cramming Cadillac Square. They had, a, they had to shut down the entryways about an hour and a half before the draft because so many people were cramming in here. I do believe we're 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 hearing uh, uh, we're at the Neil Diamond um, cover portion of tonight. I had, I had a pause. <laughs> Annual for that hold, hold, hold a second, Rich. I, I had a pause for that moment. Neil Diamond cover section in the Motor City. Uh, you know what? Seriously, it Motown town here. Hey. M was on stage, and we're going Neil Diamond. I'm not. I'm not gonna. I don't have nothing to retort. He's not going to disparage it, 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 Neil not Diamond. Right. That's it's not, not right. No, no, no. He uh, won't I'll do. I'm not, dispar I'm, he I'm not disparaging Neil Diamond. Just know your city. Fifth, five quarterbacks in the first ten. Fifty percent of the first ten quarterbacks. Hundred percent of the first ten offensive players. First time we've ever seen both. And we'll see if the Denver Broncos keep this a fifty percent quarterback hit rate because Bo Nix is sitting out there. And we'll see if that's who they're going to be picking right now. Do you remember at the top Denver. we said what the strength of the draft? It's quarterbacks, it's wide receivers, and tackles. Just to confirm, there are also other players available yeah. at other positions I mean, at is, some point. Is in it time. the corner? Wait, there are Hold defenders? I think, I think Ian Rappaport wants in. Ian? Ian, are there defenders? There are defenders. There just really haven't been any taken. You guys mentioned the quarterbacks. We've had five goes so far. There's really only one more. Bo Nix, who teams have had rated anywhere near the first round. That means we've got the Denver Broncos, we've got the Los Vegas Raiders. Both have quarterback needs. If one goes him, the other's not going to get him. And I would say this, for the Las Vegas Raiders, who didn't have Bo Nix up there with some other teams, they may actually trade out or take a defensive player rather than reach for a quarterback. The Raiders are okay. They have Gardner Minshew, but there is a chance they don't get a quarterback out of round one. The Raiders are currently on the clock halfway through it right now, and the Denver pick and, and is Rich, in. And Rich, think about it this way. If the Raiders wanted a quarterback, it's the Broncos' spot. There's not going to be call, talk of a trade no. right there to help out a division rival. No. You look at no the color chance. ID. Uh, uh, absolutely no. not. <laughs> not. Not in our division. I mean, the Vikings and the Jets, last time they made a trade for a quarterback, right, or involved a quarterback, any transaction involved a quarterback, was Brett Favre, right? When Brett used the Jets as a transfer portal to get to Minnesota to get back to Green Bay. <laughs> the NIL money was better. It was great. Pretty much. <laughs> Is, is, is Roger trying to let them finish with their Neil Diamond song? No, it was the hug. I, it's got to stop. It up, it's got to stop because Charles is very upset right now. I just don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> with the 12th pick in the 2024 NFL Draft, the Denver Broncos select Bo Nix. There it is. Oh. Quarterback, Oregon. Six for 12. Six quarterbacks in the first dozen picks. To quote Rambo, they're all gone, sir. <laughs> they're all, all six of the quarterbacks are gone. Bo Nix, the comparison was Tua because he's got real quick hands. He's very accurate underneath, and he can lay the ball up. Some of the drive throws, that's what people want to see. There are evidence, there is evidence out there of him driving the football. This offense just didn't require it very often. A lot of quick hitters, a lot of balls underneath. But the ability there, he's played a lot of football, started 61 games in college. That's where you see the polish and things like this with ball handling. He's played so much football. The mobility at Auburn, you saw more of. A little sprinkled in here. Didn't have to run it quite as much with this Oregon <laughs> offense. I thought they would trade down, but I think the fact that the five other guys were gone, they weren't going to get cute. That's the moral of the story. Don't get cute this year. Get your guy. That's the fam cam presented by Rocket Mortgage in Alabama. Jackson's Gap, Alabama. Seeing Bo Nix celebrating with his friends and family and with the Raiders right after. Maybe they, they would have gone there. You know, who knows? But Sean Payton sends Russell Wilson packing. He's now in Pittsburgh. And it's Bo Nix a couple days after they acquire Zach Wilson via trade. And we all know Jared Stidham is in their quarterback room. And that's the way they're going to go into the season with a monster dead cap there it is. number hanging over them over the next couple of years that they're paying off from the Russell Wilson trade and the Russell Wilson contract on which Russell Wilson played a grand total of zero downs for Denver. Kurt? 
I tell you what, guys, when you watch Bo Nix on film, he reminds you a little bit of Drew Brees. Drew Brees, Sean Payton, we know what they did together, but he played in an offense where they asked him to read the entire field. Probably the biggest playbook of all of these quarterbacks that we've seen go in the first round. And so I believe that's where the fit is. They're going to ask Bo Nix to come in and deal the football, get the football out of his hands, use that accuracy. And as DJ said, he can push the ball down the field, but I'm not sure that's what they're going to ask him to do. Sean Sean Payton now has a quarterback that can do some of the things that they like to do in New Orleans. Well, Kurt, now that the uh, six first-round graded am, quarterbacks am, have been taken out? for, for am 12 I done? picks. No, I, I've been told they're checking on to see if there's early flights. Okay, uh, all right, all right. In it's been fun, but, guys. It's but, been fun. No, no, no. I'm going to say this because I'm your teammate and I have your back. You're not just a quarterback guy. You can talk about other draft choices at other positions you're not we're not putting baby in a corner you're just not in a box well thank you rich you're i appreciate welcome. it and it's all offensive guys so far too so i can talk offense for sure yes They're probably going to be a couple defensive guys going but that said we also know you only travel first class and there's only coach <laughs> seats back <laughs> i've been told so oh. we'll be back to you oh, hey, hey, hey one one thing guys secret sauce in this whole thing is a guy by the name of davis webb this is a quarterback's coach in Denver for Sean Payton. He's going to be one of the top quarterback coaches in the NFL starting right now and look at the project he gets here.